Set up ExpressVPN on Chromebook. This tutorial will show you how to download, set up, and use your VPN app for Chromebook. Before proceeding, please check that your Chromebook supports Android apps. Android apps are now available on Asus Chromebook Flip, Acer Chromebook R11-C738T-CB5132T, Google Chromebook Pixel, 2015. You can verify this by checking the list of Chrome OS systems supporting Android apps at https colon slash slash googl slash yb1y7u. Contents, enable dev or beta channels. Download the VPN app. Set up the VPN app. Connect to a VPN server location. Disconnect from a VPN server location. Choose a different server location. How to run the ping test. How to switch VPN protocols. How to uninstall the VPN app from your Chromebook. Trouble connecting? Try these tips. 1. Enable dev or beta channels. Before you download the app, you'll need to enable the dev or beta channels on your administrator account. Click the status area, where your account picture appears. Click settings. At the top of settings, click about Chrome OS. Click more info. Under channels, click change channel. Select beta or developer, then click change channel. 2. Download ExpressVPN VPN app. Switch from your administrator account to a regular user account. This can be done by clicking your status area and then sign out. Sign back in using your regular user account credentials. On your desktop, click the Google Play Store icon. In the Play Store search bar, search for ExpressVPN. Select ExpressVPN, VPN for Android from the search results and click install. Click accept to begin the download. 3. Set up ExpressVPN VPN app. After the download is completed, you will see the ExpressVPN app icon in your list of applications. You can also search for it by typing ExpressVPN in your list of applications. Click the ExpressVPN app icon to open the app. Click login to begin the setup process. Enter the email address and password you used to sign up for ExpressVPN and then click login. After you've signed in, you will be informed that ExpressVPN is now activated for your Android device. Click next to continue. Your app will ask if you'd like to share anonymous information to help make ExpressVPN faster and more reliable. Click OK if you'd like to share anonymous analytics. 4. Connect to a VPN server location. To connect to a VPN server location, click the on button. By default, ExpressVPN will suggest the location that provides the optimal experience for you, a feature called Smart Location. The first time you try connecting to a VPN server, you will see an allow connection notification. Click OK to proceed. Once you see the VPN is on message on the app screen, you can begin surfing with freedom and security. As noted above, only apps downloaded from the Google Play Store will be protected by the VPN. Note, a single Express VPN subscription can be used simultaneously on three devices, regardless of platform. If you try to use more than three devices simultaneously on one subscription, you will see the below screen, 5. Disconnect from a VPN server location. To disconnect from the VPN server, Click the on button while the VPN is on. You will know you are disconnected when the VPN is off message shown. 6. Choose a different VPN server location. To connect to a different server location, click on choose location to launch the location picker. To search for a location, enter a location name in the text search or browse the all locations tab. Text search, type the name of the country or city you'd like to connect to. The search results will narrow down to fit what you entered. When you see the server location you want to connect to, click on it to connect. All locations tab, expand the arrows to view the locations in a certain geographic region. To connect to a server location, click on it. If you would like to add a location to your favorites list for easy future access, simply click the star icon at the right of the location. To view your favorite locations, click on the favorites tab. You can connect to a location by clicking on it. 7. How to run the ping test. To run the ping test, click the speedometer icon at the top of the screen. Note, you must be disconnected from the VPN in order to run the ping test. Click on run test to run the ping test. 8. How to switch VPN protocols. VPN protocols are the methods by which your device connects to a VPN server. Switching to a different protocol can help you achieve faster connection speeds. To switch VPN protocols, click the About menu, in the top left corner of the screen. In the menu, click Settings. From the Settings menu, under VPN Settings, click VPN Protocol. Select your preferred protocol by clicking on it. 9. How to uninstall the VPN app from your Chromebook. On your desktop, click the Google Play Store icon. In the Play Store search bar, search for ExpressVPN. Select ExpressVPN. VPN for Android from the search results and click Uninstall. Click OK to confirm you want to uninstall the app 10. Trouble connecting? Try this section. If you encounter the ton driver missing error, please use this troubleshooting guide, later, to fix it.